Hello everyone, Charmin Sin here and today I'm showing you a graphical front end for Clam Antivirus. I have a lot of people ask me uh, if there's a GUI for Clam Antivirus so they can kind of use it uh, like you use your Avast or AVG or McAfee um, software and yes there is a solution and it's called Clam TK. Okay, it's available on their source for, uh, sorry, their Google code page of code.google.com uh, slash clam tk and obviously it's uh, free uh, it supports Fedora, CentOS, um, Debian so pretty much uh, any Debian uh, sorry any uh, Linux system uh, I believe that there is a Windows system uh, Windows front end for it as well but uh, I could be wrong uh, you might want to look into that if you're using Windows so um, the graphical front end is very simple to install. You can use it. Uh, you can either download it through the App Store or the Software Center, or just uh, sudo apt get install clam tk. Okay. So um, to use this uh, software, it's actually pretty simple. So to do your updates, instead of having to do fresh clam in, in the command line, you could just double click update and uh, the antivirus uh, signatures will download. I have mine set obviously to uh, download my updates automatically which you can do by double clicking update assistant and click my computer automatically receives updates and then you hit apply and uh, it'll automatically do that for you. Um, so you have you have a history a button so you can see when you know, if you click view here you'll see what was done in your last scan um, you you have your average settings here okay. and then you have the basic you have the regular run-of-the-mill options so scan a file scan a directory so for example if I want to scan my temp directory just click OK and it'll do its thing so scan five files no threats detected okay now it has one unique feature which I kinda like so it has you can submit a file for analysis so if I have say um, security.patch Right, and I want to check and see if that's a file, if that's a threat. I can submit it for analysis, and it'll say there's no information for this file, and um, and uh, basically it'll say pretty much that the the file is not a threat. Okay. So then you uh, you have your network stuff here. This is more for the updates and stuff. So you normally don't have to do anything. If you do use a proxy, um, you'll have to configure it here. Okay, and then there's a scheduler. Now the scheduler, um, you can say uh, when you want your your antiviruses to antivirus to be updated, uh, set up a scan, all that stuff here. So I hope this uh, video helps you um, uh, helps you with this. If you're looking for a graphical front end for um, for your Clam antivirus, this is definitely a good choice and very light. I think it's only a 10 meg install, and um, and yeah. So if you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the video description below, or sorry, in the comment section below. And uh, you can also visit my website, which is www.chanmancini.com. Speak with you soon.